Hey guys and girls and welcome to week 7 of Let's Play Marriage Strikers Charge Football. Last week we saw Princess Daisy vs Wario defeating him 6-3 and vs Donkey Kong Jr defeating him thankfully 2-0. That was quite a hard match for them but they managed to pull it through. This week we will see her vs Yoshi and Koopa, that is King Koopa. What will this week hold for the princess? There's only one way to find out. Let's get it on! Princess Daisy vs Little Green Dinosaur And this week they're going to be playing in Pipeline Central which is a classic match for Mario Smash Football And here he comes Yoshi's pumped and he's ready to go and his team have got themselves a nice little power up already. But that's nothing compared to the first goal of the match, predictably scored by the Hammer Brother. Way to go, what a fantastic start to the match. Scored from midfield, nice one Hammer Brother. Yoshi may have to pull something out of the bag if he expects to beat Team Daisy. Ooh, Toad wanted a goal and he didn't quite manage it. Monty Mole just hit him with the... Uh, the homing shells and it needs to be careful because there's still some knocking about. And my brother wanted another skull, uh, another uh, another goal for midfield. Didn't quite get it. Plenty of passing going on. Both teams really shouldn't have too much of a too much of an issue with this pitch as it's simple, solid ground. So no obstacles or environmental hazards to get in the way, so just plain honest to goodness football. And Daisy's going for a mega strike. She's got her four balls set up. How many will she get in? None. Krita saves all four balls, denying Princess any goals. But it's still early folks, it's still early. Toad prevents the uh, Yoshi's mega strike. And Hammer Brother scores 2-0! Yoshi's not happy already. Monty Mole tries to console him. There's still a lot to play for. They've still got a minute to go. Or less than, but Yoshi can probably still do it. If he gets in an awesome mega strike, he has a good chance of catching up. And excuse me, I meant uh, two minutes to go. So we've still got it all to play for. But not when you got the Mushroom Man on the case. First goal for Toad this week. Toad not known for scoring many goals, he's more of a passing uh, expert, but you can't blame them for having a smile on their face every time they score. Daisy trying to get for the ball, and she manages to get it, passes to Toad, Toad's and Hammer Brother. Oh, Toad wanted another goal in, he, he's, feeling the, he's feeling it. Oh, Seth's quit his hands on fire. Toad really wants that goal. He really wants it. He's going for it. He's he's just hammering away at Prisa. Princess Daisy tries for another goal. Oh, she's got herself another Mega Strike, and she's powered up her four balls. How many will she get in? It's going to be half a quitter. One. Two. Could have been a lot worse. He saved, managed to save two goals, but if Team Yoshi don't do anything, they really need to pick up their game now because Team Daisy is ahead 5 0. Ball bounced off of uh, Monty Mole there, but Yoshi's got himself a nice chain chomp. Toad going for the goal again. Everyone's trying to get away from, uh, from, the, from the chain chomp. And Yoshi's now got himself a mega strike. In it goes. Okay, how many is Critter going to save? Will Yoshi get the chance to catch up? Unfortunately, the answer is no. Critter saves all four balls. So far, Daisy's team still leading perfectly. Oop, one more managed to stop the ball there. Smashes hammer with Butler in the face in the process. 
the crowd shining for Yoshi. And Princess Daisy makes it 6-0. First goal from the Princess. Well, first proper goal that is. Not counting her Mega Strikes. The crowd really getting behind Yoshi. Oh, Daisy very nearly had the seventh goal. Oh, he's got his egg roll going on. Oh, and Krilla manages to stop the Mega Strike. Well done, Krilla. Yoshi going for a corner kick. The crowd's still behind Yoshi. Toad wanted the seventh goal, but it's too late. Team Daisy wins 6 0. Daisy defeated Yoshi. She destroyed him. Which is a damn shame when you think about it, because Yoshi really is one of the nicer characters to play against. And match highlight number three from Hammer Brother from midfield. Kura stood no chance. Match highlight number two that undoubtedly comes from. It comes from the little toad, of course. One of his rare goals. Definitely has to be a highlight. And of course, the highlight of the match comes from. The Hammer Brother. Who, quite, to be honest, almost deserves every highlight he gets. An excellent goal scorer and certainly on form this week. 6 0 to Team Daisy. Okay, here we go. The next match sees Daisy up against the mighty King Koopa. Roar! Will the princess be able to dethrone the king? Let us find out. And she dons her blue uniform. Well, here they are playing in the dump. The environmental hazard being the slippery floor, so passing is going to be a bit of an issue. And here she comes, the Princess of Soa, 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 I can't pronounce the name of the land, she's a uh, princess over. <laughs> I can tell you certainly one thing, Bowser certainly has no intentions of kidnapping this princess. Daisy teleports the other end of the pitch, probably a wise decision, just after taking down Bowser. Hammer Brother won the first goal, he probably nearly got it, but it seemed that Boo just got in the way, literally off the ball. Korea saves it in a very nice save as well. I can imagine it's actually quite hard to save against the Hammer Brother. And everyone, everyone's trying their best to get the ball, but the pitch is just proving to be too much. Krita with some nice saves against the Hammer Brother. Daisy wanting the ball, pass it to the Hammer Brother, and then just getting it back to their side of the pitch so they can power up the ball. And a nice goal from midfield from the Hammer Brother. Yeah, first goal of the match puts Princess Daisy ahead. King Cooper's going to have to up his game now if he wants to beat the Princess. That's going to be quite difficult in this pitch. Well, in that set, I think people with a speed, the characters with a speed ability, may have a slight advantage with the slippery floor because they can go just a little bit further. So, nobody can move too quickly in this, on this pitch, otherwise they're just gonna slip and slide over. It's just like walking on ice. Daisy wanting the ball badly. Oh, and she gets frozen for her efforts. Poor Princess Daisy. Toad takes down Monty Mole, prevents him from getting that ball. Daisy trying for another goal, but it's not easy. So she's going to try for a Mega Strike instead. She does not have to rely on being on the pitch. One, two, and three goals. Now, if Team Daisy can just keep possession of the ball, prevent Team Bowser from scoring any, they should be alright. That's basically, probably their main objective now in this entire match, just keep possession of the ball. Bow means score if you want, but just make sure that the opposite opposing team just don't get it. Hammer Brother taking down Bowser, and Bowser was not impressed with that, he's just, he's burning everyone. 
Everyone making sure the ball is well away from King Cooper. And Toe tries for the goal, didn't quite get it in. Daisy going for another Mega Strike. She has been very Mega Strike happy this week. She knows it's going to be quite difficult to keep possession of the ball in this slippery field. But with four goals to her, to her name, bringing her total score up to 8-0, she is decimating the king. Toad with a bit of speed and sets, uh, sets the poor Cooper troop on fire. Toad tries for the goal. Oh, Monty Mole taking down the poor Toad. He's going for it. He's going for the goal. Oh, and Toad kicks the ball away. Nice defence there from Toad. And a lovely goal from the Hammer Brother. 9 0 from midfield. King Cooper definitely not pleased about the score. He's going to have to pick his game up in the next 20 seconds. I'm going to be honest with you guys, I don't think he's going to be able to do it. The might of Princess Daisy is just proving too much. Oh, 9 1. First goal for King Bowser. Oh, Hammer Brothers going for his mega attack and he gets it in! 10 1 to Team Daisy! It's academic. King Cooper is not going to come back in 6 seconds. Team Daisy Mel's just stand there and lay some bananas. <laughs> and he slips up on one! <laughs> oh my goodness! He was moving so slowly, he should have been able to see the banana skip, but he still slips up on one! Oh, what a fantastic match. 10-1 to Team Daisy. And there's the third highlight number three. Hammer Brothers, awesome goal. You don't want to get in the way of those hammers. we got match highlight number two. Undoubtedly, the goal from midfield. Match highlight number one. Another midfield shot from the Hammer Brother. You definitely can rely on him if you want your goal scores. Him and Berhado. Oh, excuse me. 10 1. Is anything going to stop Princess Daisy? Oh. Well, that's it for this week, guys. That was quite an explosive and very energetic start to. Well, just an explosive and energetic week. Can we expect some, more of the same next week? Well, only one way to find it out. You'll have to tune in next time. Daisy and Yoshi are tied for scoring the most goals. However, Daisy proving her worth by only conceding four goals. So until next week, guys, take care of yourselves.